Hi and welcome. My name is Mark Tyers and I'm a senior lecturer in the Department of Computing at Coventry University. And this is the first of a series of four labs covering the basic JavaScript skills that you will need if you want to study 305 CDE next year. Now, <clears throat> you might be someone who's coming from 205 CDE, in which case you may have covered these skills may wish to go back over them to revise. If you're an Erasmus student, an informatics student, or you've been on placement, I would advise that you go through these four labs before you join the first lab of 305 CDE. In 305 CDE, we're going to be developing full stack JavaScript applications, sophisticated applications using the advanced features of modern JavaScript. And JavaScript is the most important language out there on the web. If you master JavaScript, there's no end to what you can achieve in terms of developing apps and games for the web. But before you do that, you need to master the basics. So we'll assume when you join us at the end of September that you've already mastered this content. If you haven't done this, you are not going to cope with the module. If this is an optional module for you and you find you're struggling with this basic stuff, I think that's a kind of an indicator to you that maybe this is not the right module for you to be taking. So <clears throat> make sure that you complete all the materials. Now, the structure we're going to be using is the same structure we're going to be using for the 305 labs once you start the module. Um, the first thing you should be watching for each lab is a short introductory video. And this is what you're watching right now. This is a short introductory video for the first lab. Once you finish watching this video, and I'll try and keep them short, is you should be attempting the worksheet. And the worksheet is a carefully structured series of tasks that you should be carrying out before you continue with the module. And this should take you about 45 minutes to one hour to complete if you work hard. Once you've completed the worksheet, you need to watch a second video called the concepts video. And in the concepts video, I'm going to be talking through some of the concepts behind what we've been doing in the workshop. When you've finished the worksheet and you've finished watching the concepts video, you need to just be working on an extended challenge. Now the extended challenge you're going to be working on for these four labs, you're going to bring that with you to the first lab for 305 CDE and show us what you've done. <clears throat> but once you've started 305 CDE, that extended challenge becomes your assessed coursework. So this is really a dry run of the process and the flow to get you up to speed so you know what you should be doing. <clears throat> so having watched this video, go away, fire up the worksheet and work through the steps carefully one by one and make sure you understand what you're doing in them. And I'll see you back in about an hour's time to watch the concept video. Good luck.